British researchers are applying the Lego approach to their work with robots. They're trying to get a swarm of mini-bots to form one big machine so it could perform tasks too difficult or dangerous for humans. Until now, it's been the staff of science fiction, small robots that adapt to work together, not always for the good of humankind. But it was this TV series that gave engineers an idea. And in this box of tricks is an early prototype for how similar technology could benefit the real world. The aim of this project, the, the Symbrian project, is to develop a, a swarm of robots, a swarm of robots that can physically self-assemble. What we want to do in the next five years is to design the robot so that they can physically join and create a kind of three-dimensional artificial organism. And this mock-up, admittedly not very sci-fi, shows how the swarm robots could operate. The hope is that given time, they would manage their own hardware and software, even self-heal where damaged. And there are some ambitious aims for how the technology could be used, such as releasing the robots into collapsed buildings. They could work alongside emergency teams to search for survivors, open up communications channels, lift rubble, even apply first aid. But with a mind of their own, should we be worried? So no risk that the robots may take over? No, I don't think there's any risk at all of that. And maybe those fears are misplaced as the prototype is yet to master the tabletop. But with European Union funding, it's hoped a little bit of science fiction will become a reality as early as 2025.